We use password to protect our information from thieves. When we are online, we are careful about sharing our personal information with wrong kinds of people for our safety reasons. But what about your dreams? Do you have a particular individual to share your dreams with? For example, your mom, your dad or your sister? Or do you share your dreams with anyone? Have you ever thought of protecting your dreams? Hi, it's Somi and in today's video, I will be discussing about dream stealers and how to identify them. If you are interested in this topic, then keep watching. I upload videos on self-improvement, goal setting and how to achieve them every Monday. So if you are interested in these types of content, then please subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss on any videos. Who are dream stealers? Dream stealers destroy your dreams by bringing you down and making you believe that you cannot achieve your dreams. There are two types of dream stealers. One are the people who are jealous of you and don't want you to succeed. Second one are your loved ones. Your loved ones are dream stealers, not because they don't want you to succeed. They are dream stealers because they want you to keep safe. They don't want you to take risk so that you can be safe. And always remember, your loved ones will be the first one to say you can't achieve it. How to identify dream stealers? Number one, negative people. Don't ever share your dreams with negative people because they will always have something negative to say about your dreams. The moment you share your dreams with them, they will discourage you. Always remember this. Negative people are part of cheap seats. You have decided that instead of sitting in the cheap seats, you will go and stand in the center of arena. Those negative people don't have the courage to stand in the center of arena as you have. That's why they want to bring you down and they want to bring you to the level of the cheap seats. Type 2 critical or realistic person. When you share your goals with them, they will force you to think how will you achieve that goal. And that time you will not be able to think that exact ways of achieving your goal. So you will be discouraged. And the fact is that no one knows exactly how they are going to achieve the goal. You just trust in yourself, trust in the universe, and just take necessary actions. You don't need to know how will you get that goal. If you want to have a dream job, then you don't need to know how will the HR manager I will select you. The only thing you have to do is prepare for your interview and give it your best. Because we don't know what life has stored for us. We might get some opportunities that we may not be aware of initially when we just start working to our goals. Let me share a small story with you. Once there was a child who belonged from family who just earned enough just to survive. He did not belong from a rich family. So one day at school, their teacher gave them homework. What do you want to become when you grow up? So that child wrote that when he grew up, he want to buy a 90 acres land. I don't remember exact how many, but a pretty large land and use that land so that people can train their horse and take care of them in their land. So when he submitted that essay to the teacher, she gave him F. And the next day, the teacher went and reached out to the child and asked that this dream that you have thought is not possible to achieve it. You can write any other dream if you want a better grade. You know what the child said? The child said, you keep your F grade and I will keep my dream. 
and currently he has those things that he wanted when he was child i cannot remember the name of that person but it is there in the success principle book third type people who want to save you from taking risks mostly our loved ones come under this category they want to protect you and keep you safe maybe that is one of the main reasons why parents are reluctant when their child wants to start a new business instead of uh, working in a stable job that is way out of his interest type 4 people with fixed mindset people with fixed mindset do not believe in growth or change again this may include loved ones loved ones especially your parents have seen you since you were a little baby some of them may not be ready to accept that their little one has grown up and been the mature one and the last type type number 5 these are the complainers they will always complain about the world how it is bad and it will not allow you to perceive your dreams and it will make you feel discouraged so there you go these are some people who you do not want to share your dreams with i was only able to come up with these five types of people but if you think that there are other types of dream stealers then comment down below or you can dm me in on my instagram account which is swami chatterjee yt and while you are there go follow me there as i have said in the last video which was on how to be successful in life if you have not watched that video then please watch it so that whatever dreams you have set for yourself you can achieve it very easily so as i was saying that in the last video i talked about to hang out with like minded people and share your dreams with like minded people when you start following your dreams people will make fun of you they will laugh at you and think that how dumb you are but only you know the true meaning and importance of that goal and if you say that i was not able to achieve this dream because that person said this this is that person discouraged it so were you really serious about your dreams just give it a thought you are responsible for achieving your goals if you cannot achieve your dreams then it's your fault don't blame the others for it so no matter what people say or do you just chase your dreams and with this we have come to the end of this video thank you guys so much for supporting me by watching this video if you have found some value out of it then please hit the like button to show me some love if you want more self improvement content that will help you to be the best version of yourself then please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon so that you can always be on the right path thank you guys so much for watching this video and i will see you next monday bye